hello in previous video we have um, wrote the code for um, how to define how to derive thick shell thickness of um, this by longitudinal stresses and by circumferential stresses now for next video uh, i am doing for uh, plot graph like this one it is only small changes changes in this python code it will lead to uh, go for mislead to you in this graph so how to write that python code this is simple python code this is uh, import and numpy as np it is for array import matplot library it is for plotting this our data it's like we have to create this graph so we will import matplot as plt d means input our diameter E means starting pressure and SE means allowable limit. It is our simple equation T is equal to P. It is our previously you have can, you have seen that. Now we'll look for full loop. Full loop means it will uh, continuously uh, changing one value to another. Means here you can see that in this equation p uh, here is um, variable so if it is means p means starting pressure if you put here 10 so it is it will range 10 to 10 plus 5 means 15 and it will increment 0.1 so first starting point is 10 10 10.1 10.2 10.3 10.4 in front dot 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 up to 15 so so in this equation this pressure will vary from 10 to uh, 15 so now this data is stored in this pressure array and thickness is stored in thickness array now we have to plot this pressure and thickness so pressure versus thickness so plt plot pressure thickness this r means nothing but it is indication of plus sign I will show you in figure PLT X label is pressure this is for only just label and this is Y label thickness and this is PLT show means show the graph now if we run this code inner diameter is 1000 mm and starting pressure is around 10 MPa our allowable limit is 110 MPa so this is our graph pressure versus thickness if our diameter is 1 meter then if it is pressure at um, 12 MPa then our thickness is around um, 57 mm so like that you can create the one very small graph now in next video we will go for 3 axis graph this in the uh, you can see that this vary from vessel diameter vessel thickness and this one is vessel pressure so in next video we'll look for for this three type of means three dimensional graph thank you friend